Me before getting Baldur's Gate 3. Me after. Unable to stop playing till 5am. What do you mean by why? You asked me to do it. Why are you uninstalling Baldur's Gate 3? Hold on. This whole operation was your idea. Larian. Can I play the game offline? Yes, you can play the game offline. However, certain features, such as multiplayer modes or online events, may require an internet connection. Are there any in-game purchases? No, there are no in-game purchases in our game. We believe in providing a complete and immersive gaming experience without the use for additional purchases. Enjoy the game to its fullest without any additional costs or microtransactions. Other publishers. How it feels playing this game. Why having low intellect is an advantage in Baldur's Gate 3. Normal brain. Brain damage. Dead. Superior brain small. Brain can dodge. Alive. Me in just a few more hours. Me. I don't want to play with you anymore. Babe. It's morning. Time for your daily 14 hours of playing Baldur's Gate 3. Yes honey. Why do we have hands? There are many reasons. Pat Shadow Heart. Hold Shadow Heart. Cherish Shadow Heart. Forfeit all mortal possessions to Shadow Heart. Me romancing the men. Me romancing the women. I fear no man. But that thing. Perception failed. It scares me. One of my party members detects the trap. All the other party members. I'm gonna pretend I didn't see that. 91.6% finish the tutorial. As opposed to the listed 0.1% of players. Everything is balked, my dudes. Trust no stats. The remaining 8.4% of the people in character creator. YouTube.com. You. Guide for best class. Best companion for best recent class choice. Guide on how to complete the quest of blah blah blah. Don't miss this item. Me every time I fail a very important role. Load saved game. After all, why not? Load saved game. Why shouldn't I reload? I live in the character creation screen. Down, down, down by the river. Every streamer giving me minimum maximum meter gaming advice for a solo D&D game. Deciding to play a half orc cleric, because that's what I picked in 1979 in our War Games Club first D&D game using the blue book. Me watching my remote download at work today. Man I look ugly in the cutscenes. Before I leave the camp. Two seconds after I leave the camp. When you learn about throwing potions on the ground. One potion to heal them all. You think having ability bonus is not bound to your race, allowing more character freedom, improves the game experience? I do, and I'm tired of pretending it's not. Sacrifices must be made, so we may move on to better things. I uninstalled it, and not just the game, but my saved games and my mods too. I uninstalled it like it was garbage. It's time to go. Was I a good early access? No, you were the best. When you start playing a warlock for the first time. Eldritch Blast. Cantrip Evocation. Wait. It's all Eldritch Blast? Always has been. YouTube now is like. Which class should I play? How to subclass. Beginner tips. No oh oh oh. I don't want to know. Leave me alone. Baldur's Gate 3 not even release yet. You save scram to pass skill checks. I save scram. Because I made a non-player character sad. We are not the same. Teenage Mutant Ninja Dragonborn. Monk. True Strike. Cantrip Divination. You're as useless as in the tabletop. Say the line again. Warlock. I cast Eldritch Blast. When you miss a melee hit. After all. Why not? Why shouldn't I shove? I need you to remain in the camp for a while. Level up. Level up. Level up. How I feel when I play tactical mode. Fire weapon. Hit. 65%.
need mode creators realizing they are not needed in Baldur's Gate 3. POV. You just respect Shadow Hearts subclass to Light Domain. Perception failed. Chuckles. I'm in danger. Being retired. Being retired when Baldur's Gate 3 comes out. Me while Eldritch blasting bosses into chasms and lava. Me not able to get their loot or collect their head. I'll have a evocation cantrip. Make it a firebolt. How original. And make sure it's a miss. Daring today, aren't we? What I saw. What I wanted. What I expected. What I got. Cries in PS5. You lucky bastards. Duck you and I'll see you next month. An actual footage of me trying out an evil playthrough. Druids in bear form can't sit in chairs. It's Baldur's Gate time. Human fighter. Explorer difficulty. New F5 and F9 keys. 100% playthrough guide on the second monitor. People telling Larian to hurry up. Me. Larian. When you push an enemy into a chasm. When an enemy pushes you into a chasm. Male PC in every cutscene. When your Baldur's Gate 3 character talks to anyone. Me. So you are a developer of this game? Swenvink? Yes, I am. Me. That must mean you are very good at this game, right? Swenvink? Being unemployed. Being unemployed when Baldur's Gate 3 comes out. Most trustworthy? Be aware. 25%. CD Projekt Red. 22%. Larian Studios, 42%. Bethesda, 10%. The facial expressions in the game are quite impressive. Shadow heart when I'm talking. Shadow heart when Liesel starts talking. Muscle mommy Karlach. My dwarf paladin. All I ask is for you to get to know me on a deep intimate level while I resist and obstruct your every attempt to do so. If you cast light on equipment on the ground, it stays lit when you equip it. Party, we have to get this mind flayer tadpole out of our heads now or we're doomed. Me. Oh no. Anyway. It's 3am. Wake up for release. Yes honey. 6 feet versus 5 feet 11. I'll just buy early access. I'll just create a character. I'll just finish the tutorial. 35 hours played last week. A quick tip for all you paladins trying to keep your oaths. Attacking non-aggressive non-player characters. Saying by Selun I will bring you to justice. Then attacking non-aggressive non-player characters. Me and the boys watching how Tav will handle another tadpole removal attempt. The good thing about the discourse is that people have begun to rightfully talk about CRPGs as, holy shit, RPGs, and not some obscure throwback genre from the 90s. The language used to talk about this type of game is changing, and that's good for the market. Before August 3rd, where game? After August 3rd, where downloadable content? It's gaming time. Race. Human. Slags. Male. Class. Fighter. Atheists don't believe in RNG gods. League of Legends. Counter-Strike Global Offensive. World of Warcraft. Dark Souls. Baldur's Gate 3. Shout out to those who skipped TA. Our time is almost here. I did my waiting. Four years of it. In r slash Baldur's Gate 3. More tips and tricks. I wish I knew this sooner. Do not cite the deep magic to me which. Baldur's Gate. 10 essential tips you need. I was there when it was written. A nice little gadget for Baldur's Gate 3. Highlights of both games. Starfield will have over 1000 planets. Baldur's Gate 3. 
me after playing the game for 9 days, leaving my room at 4am only to stock up on snacks and caffeine. Playing EA after learning from this sub, that peaceful options give no XP. Shame. Wholesome. Strong. Tall tiefling barbarian. It's Sunday half elf dark cleric with a heart of gold. Me, trying to decide who to romance first. PSA to all I can fix her people. There's nothing but trouble inside those holes. The luck of the dice. I'll quick save just in case I miss this roll. Alright, I'll reload and try again. Surely I can't fail three times in a row. Luck is on my side this time, I can feel it. Me lying awake at night. Thinking about all the playthroughs I will make when Baldur's Gate 3 is finally released. Tav, trying to resolve the conflict peacefully. Liesel in the background. It smelled like butch in here. Me, a PS5 user, dipping into this sub, waiting for September. PSA. Familiars can make the game unplayable. 23 hours left. Which class did you choose? Why do you want me to be a human fighter? Cyberpunk 2077. Baldur's Gate 3. Customizable Gentiles. Asterian fans alike. I hate Asterian. The real struggle of a dwarven main character. There is no ultimate party in Baldur's Gate 3. Meanwhile my party. Nicolas Cage. When your party member is a mysterious, dark haired, magically inclined beauty, who will no doubt have their cold, ice queen personality defrost by the end of the game through the power of love. Friend number 653. Want to start a fresh playthrough with me? Me. 100 hours in and still in act 1. Yes honey. Ellen's cameo was the most surprising. Please. Before they return. What are you? To the helm. At the helm we are needed. I hated it in Divinity Original Sin 2, and I will hate it now, if they repeat themselves. Larian please. I'm once again asking for you, to not lock my party after Act 1. I'll have a... Dark Urge Paladin. Who resists the Miriris instinct. How original. And romances Shadow Heart. Daring today, aren't we? DND 5e. Variant human. I got you. I got you, brother. Oh, no, you don't. Slowly discovering how much freedom there is in combat. Redditors showing off their OP built in Baldur's Gate 3. Me discovering my ranger can put a lit candle next to him during battles to light up his arrows. Gale when I finally get that rare armor. Such a simple solution to his problem. Why isn't he just asking Withers to respect him into something other than a warlock? Is he stupid? Me seeing everyone talking about their honey experiences. Everybody wants to duck me. I can't get Shadow Heart to duck me. Only Liesel wants to duck me. You guys are getting laid? Baldur's Gate 3, or RPG in general, companions be like. Lore. I'm a literal disciple of a literal god of magic. My knowledge of the arcane and magical prowess are unparalleled in all the realms. I also once sneezed so hard I accidentally leveled a mountain. The memory of that tragic event still haunts me to this day. Gameplay. Level 1 wizard. Spells. 1. Fire pew. 1 to 2 damage. 10% hit chance. 2. Thunder sneeze. 1 damage. Knock affected 1 step away. 3. Big elemental pew. Maybe reliable. Maybe not. Definitely versatile. 4. I need to rest. All my companions, after we fight one goblin or use one spell slot, I'm tired, boss. When you just slaughtered a whole goblin tribe, and literally the whole party gives you that look. 
me trying to find flattered, but no thanks, and failing. 1. I want to dang you right here and now in front of everyone. 2. I want to dang you later. 3. You sick degenerate, I hope you die in a fire, so I can use you as kindling. This exchange had me dying. Shadow heart, so. Have we buried the hatchet, Liesel? Liesel, no. Why would I bury a weapon? Is it broken? Shadow heart, it's a metaphor. Liesel, I do not know your metaphor. But if you need help digging, I will find a shovel. Two types of Baldur's Gate 3 players lol. Getting rejected by 4 people in a single night, just like RL. My biggest complaint about the game is how honey everyone is. I'm hoping it's strictly an act one thing, and it goes away after turning everybody down. But so far there have been so many moments in camp that are just unnecessarily intimate out of seemingly nowhere. I feel like I've just met these people and... Me, starting a nice casual playthrough of the Dark Urge for the first time. Oh cool a new cutscene. The official response to my ticket about Asterion not taking damage from eating garlic. We, Larian.com. Support issue. Nathan. Dude. Nathan. Wait till you see him walk outside in sunlight. You're gonna scream. When you run Shadow Heart, Liesel and Asterion in your party during a good aligned playthrough, you know, I'm something of a therapist myself. Me meeting non-player characters during the first 45 minutes. Let me get this straight. Does anyone here not have tadpoles? In light of recent news, I can take a bear. In a fight, right. In a fight, right. Drow's first day in the outside world. First time out of Underdark. So exciting. Look, is that the sun? Poof. Duck. Mother was right. Using guidance on a persuasion check against Shadow Heart. Is it the 3rd of August yet? No. Then duck off. And she has no room or right to judge. You can call me Shadow Heart. Pleasure to meet you Shadow Heart. You can call me the Dark Urge. Requesting time off from work for important family business. Actually taking time off for the Baldur's Gate 3 release. Hey there. Is there a project you're working on? I know more than you. Just me or does Tav constantly look like this in cutscenes? Karlatch's heat, right? Straight girls. Guy girls. Straight men. Guy men. When I delete EA before launch, it's time to go. Was I a good early access game? No. I'm told you were the best. Did the monster have any good loot? Nap, just a potion of cure disease. Stupid random encounters. Let's finish the quest. Mommy, when is daddy coming home? To me is getting worse. Ending the longest, most fulfilling relationship of my life. Being single on August 3rd, release date of Larian Studios critically acclaimed RPG Baldur's Gate 3. Larian Studios, the employee who pitched that all since scene. A whole new world. If you play so slow, it will take ages until you reach the new content. That's my secret captain. Me, who never played early access past the first arrival at the Druid Grove. It's all new to me. Thinking about Evil Dirge playthrough. Actually committing to an Evil Dirge playthrough. Thanks gods for broken stealth mechanic. Stealth successful. Me, realizing that Baldur's Gate 3 will soon no longer be a short, linear campaign where your choices have no far-reaching consequences. Baldur's Gate 3. Me. Games I'm currently playing. 
Larian when someone wants to make shadow heart a druid for some reason. I'm going to allow this. Larian when I ask if I can change her hair slightly. Oh. My. No. Other devs having fixed release times. Swen playing 4D chess to maximize the pain Baldur's Gate 3's release causes his enemies. Please Shadow Heart, maintain the holy advice. My guidance. I can't socialize without my guidance. I need to play Baldur's Gate 3. Or, I can't fit Baldur's Gate 3 into my schedule. Baldur's Gate 3. Sleep. Work. Food. Baldur's Gate 3. Sleep. Work. Food. Baldur's Gate 3. Sleep. Work. Food. Baldur's Gate 3. Sleep. Work. It do be like that. This is the worst Monday in a while. Man I can't wait to play Baldur's Gate 3 all day. Work. Work. Family. Thrall. Connect the nerves of the transponder. Is that all you're gonna play? Yes. If your grave doesn't say rest in peace on it, you are automatically drafted into the skeleton war. Objects in the mirror are closer than their peer. Our mysterious vampire was actually a stereo, and I would have gotten away with it too, if it weren't for you meddling aid jots. My experience in the first 10 hours of the game. Quest. I'm already on a quest. I'm going to start a new game. I'm going to make different choices this time. I'll take different companions, and say act differently this time. I won't play a warlock with agonizing blast, and repelling blast this time. Always a fan of this reference. My cabbages. My beautiful cabbages. My girlfriend doesn't know what she's in for. Baby, Baldur's Gate 3 comes out today, I'm so excited. I would really love it, if you tried to play with me. It's like a board game slow paces. Okay baby. Really? Yes. Baldur's Gate 3 enemies be like. When you hear more than 2000 characters how do you feel? Regular people. Wiki editors. This entire sub. Wholesome. Strong. Tall tiefling barbarian. It's Sunday Half Elf Dark Cleric with a heart of gold. Me, during my first playthrough. Writers adding 33% extra dialogues. More characters calling you slurs, if you're tiefling or a drow. First act. Just a reminder that Shadow Heart's hair could be like this. The pain of no preload. Me with my shutty 3 megabytes per second download speed. People with a fiber connection already playing the game. Me pre-buffing my rogue, poisoning my arrow, and sneaking past 10 enemies to get a high ground and shoot at a goblin for 3 damage. Time to game. Oh wow, a fantasy RPG game with dozens of races. Race. Human. Right. Slex, male, class, knight with a long sword. Time to game. When you invest heavily in a face character, some random non-player character starts talking to Liesel. Me, a 20 chabard. Excuse me. My Baldur's Gate 3 early access characters. Me. Some friendly words for those who feel overwhelmed by hype. It's okay to ask for help. You're not a burden. Mere dear is okay. Your feelings matter. Gaming journalists trying to finish Baldur's Gate 3 in time. When it's supposed to be a touching moment, but your PC's a gif. And what do you see, exactly? 1. 
strong, piercing eyes. 2. The crease is when you laugh. 3. Your mole definitely grabs my attention. 4. Jithyanki, an elven vampire spawn, approximately 5 feet 11 inches, medium build. 5. I see someone wasting my time. I'm always stressing out when the game auto saves. Auto save successful. When the dice fail you, Misty Step comes in clutch. If nobody got me, surrounded by silver mist, you teleport to an unoccupied space you can see. I know Misty Step got me level 2 conjuration spell. Can I get an Amen? My sorcerer when there's a strength check.